All right, here's another water comparison video. Tonight we're comparing these two waters. First up is Crystal Springs Natural Spring Water. And it comes in this huge one gallon container. And next up is Naya Natural Spring Water from Quebec, Canada. This is also a very big bottle. This is one and a half liters. So what these have in common is Obviously, they're both very big bottles, and they're both spring waters, natural spring waters, and they're both from the store, the Fresh Markets. I took a trip to the Fresh Markets, and I got a ton of waters to review. Um, I actually spent close to $50 on just, on, uh, the whole trip was just waters, and um I took the bus there and had to carry all these waters back in a backpack and, you know, with my hands. And it took took uh, took me three bus trips to get to this store and then three bus trips back. And $50 is a lot of money for water. And if you, if you knew my budget, you would know how much, um, just how crazy it is that I spent $50 for water and then carried it all back. It took like, an, you know, over an hour to get back with all the different buses and anyway so that's what these two have in common uh this one was a dollar and 99 cents this one was also a dollar 99 cents um the thing about this water is they claim to really care about the environment this bottle is 100 percent recycled plastic you know with a lot of bottles they'll say like oh we're uh 20 percent or 50 percent recycled it's actually cool that this one is 100%. You know, their slogan on the back is care for the planet with a really creepy, like, weird-looking guy. Uh, I'm not sure if I like <laughs> this dude on the bottle or not. I mean, it, it if you see this guy on the bottle on the shelf, and maybe it'll get your attention. You know, it's something different, I guess. But it's kind of weird. <laughs> Just... That, that's like the main part of the bottle, just that dude. Like, what is that? What does that have to do with water? I don't know. Maybe it's about going green. Is this bottle green? I'm colorblind. Yeah, um, maybe, maybe he's colored green, and it's about going green. I don't know. Uh, it's called Naya. I wasn't sure if it was Naya at first, but I, I looked it up on YouTube, and there's people calling it Naya. So anyway, let's just open them up and do a taste test comparison this one uses the milk jug kind of bottle usually this milk jug bottle leaves like a bad taste in your mouth but you know we'll see if it does with this or not it kind of smells like a cardboard box Hmm. Oh. Hmm. You know, that's, um, going, you know, when you, when it's on your tongue, when the water's in your mouth on your tongue, it tastes really good. Nice and cold, nice, it's nice wet water. Going down your throat, it feels good, but there's kind of a bad aftertaste. I think it's just this bottle. You know, I've reviewed many of these one gallon container waters. And they all have that, that bad aftertaste to them. Um, I think it's just the type of plastic. I, I never taste that, that aftertaste when I have milk. But with water, it just really sticks out, that, the taste of the plastic. Yeah, that's no good. Um... I think Crystal is a pretty good name for a water. This is Crystal Springs Natural Spring Water. Don't be confused with Crystal Geyser, which is a water I reviewed previously. But it's, it's a pretty good name. It's nice, you know, nice and simple. This water is from Bethany Spring in Pennsylvania. And it says it's best by exactly one year from today. Today is January 17th, 
2018. This expires January 17th, 2019. It's weird that water expires at all. Um, it's probably just like an FDA rule or some law that says they have to put an expiration date on it. But Or maybe, maybe it's because the plastic seeps into the water over time. And then a year from now, it'll be just too much plastic in the water or something. I don't know. Anyway, let's move on to this. This water is from Canada. I think it's like sort of popular in Canada. This is this is the first time I've ever seen it in a store, in the fresh market store. But when I look it up on YouTube, there's like other people talking about it, but they're in Canada. And, um, you know, because obviously the company is from Canada. No smell to it. Hmm. This is kind of the opposite. This one tastes good at first, and then it has an aftertaste. This one kind of tastes bad at first, but then it tastes good after it goes down your throat. It's kind of like reversed. It's kind of weird. Let me just try it again. Yeah. It's the same thing. Okay, it, <laughs> what, it tastes bad. Let me just try to give you a better description. It's kind of like a slight chemical taste to it, like a, you know, almost like a very mild bleach kind of flavor to it. And I've, I've drank in bleach water before. This is like a much more mild um, taste, but it's kind of what it tastes like to me. So, right now... It's kind of stupid of me to be doing this review right now. Look, right now it's 4... 4.14 in the a.m. I should be really sleeping right now. I have to wake up in like a couple hours to start my day. Um, this is the third review I've done today, so I've... I've had a lot of water tonight. It's also kind of stupid to drink a ton of water right before you go to bed. But that's what I'm doing. Um, it's pretty close. Honestly, neither of these are great. I kind of had high hopes, like just based on the on the label and you know the the type of bottle and this being a spring water. I kind of had really high hopes for this one. I, I had high expectations. Um, and I'm gonna say that this one is the winner because it's better than this. But it's still, this is honestly not a great water. Um, some guy on, on YouTube was reviewing it. And he gave it a 3 out of 5 stars. And when I saw the review, that seemed kind of low. But now that I'm tasting it, I kind of agree with him. I, I would give this a 3 out of 5, basically. It's cool that it's like... Maybe it has the weird taste because it's 100% recycled. You know, maybe I'm used to like non-recycled plastic maybe because it's recycled it has that weird taste to it alright it's done thanks for watching everyone uh, goodbye.